Hi, welcome to a quick video on how to use this really great tool. It's an extension called DraftBack. This is so awesome for the writing process in using Google Docs. So let me show you how we use it. Here's a document that I created, and as you can tell by the text, if you're reading any of it, I spent a lot of time and effort thinking about it and putting it together for you. So now, if this was an assignment and I was going to turn this into a teacher, I click the Turn In button, I'm using Google Classroom, now my teacher might want to see how I actually got all of this written down. You know, did it just appear like with a copy paste or, or what? So in order for my teacher to do this, she clicks on the Draft Back button, and you can see that when I click the, back, the draft back button, that there are 342 revisions just for this one little piece of, you know, this one document right here. I, I don't, don't have much writing on it. And, and it will show me each and every keystroke, including every space, every delete, everything in a movie format, which is really awesome for me. So now as a teacher, I can sit there and I can see where they've erased words, where they've gone back and they've added other words. It helps me to understand that what they know about the writing process. It can also help our students to go back and understand what they were writing about. Sometimes as we're writing, we forget what we meant to say or what, what that thought was in our head. And this may have a chance to trigger that and remind them. I can also view the revisions in real time, which allows me to see, see, you know, was there a big pause before a big word? Maybe they're looking it up in the dictionary. Or if a big block of text just appears um, all at once, then I know that that was probably a copy paste. And that's a red flag to me that I might need to go and inquire with that student what they were doing. How do they get that text into their document so quickly? Nobody can type that fast. So this, that, that, this is a really good tool for teachers and again for students as well. This extension is free. So the first thing you want to do is you want to Google draft back, click on the Chrome store application link, okay, and add it to your Chrome. Once it's there, you'll be able to use it on all your Google Docs. However, those are going to only be the Google Docs that you have edit rights to. So your students have to share with you and give you edit rights in order for you to be able to use this with student work. If anything that you create, it will be there. And if somebody else uh, shares things with you, you have to have edit rights in order to use it. Well, give it a try because it is awesome.